It's your favorite time I read it, and I'm back. It's what I'm never going to read. I'm back with a, a pandemic pregnancy vlog. Um, I'm throwing up, and I decided that this is what I'm experiencing today. This is what I'm going through. So, why not film it? And obviously, I'm not going to actually film like me throwing it. But, I drank milk, like a cup of milk today, and I'm lactose intolerant. I knew that before I was pregnant. I don't ever really drink milk. And today, I really wanted some sugary milk, so I drank it. And I have been paying for it all day. All day, I've been super gaseous. Um, like this is bloat. It's so much gas up in there. So yeah, I'm trying to, um, today I'm going to do a video of me getting Jonathan out the door for work. Cause I'm going to show y'all what I do in the morning for him. But yeah, right now I'm trying to gear up energy because it's the end of the night. At the end of the night is when I have the most to do. I try to clean my house. Try to make sure Kamaya's room is clean. Um, our bedroom is clean. She gets in a bath, which I'm I'm not feeling good, so she's not going to get in a bath tonight. She's going to get in a shower. Um, but yeah, nighttime is always when I have to gear myself up to have a whole bunch of energy, so... Um, I'm trying to throw up this last bit of nauseousness that I'm feeling. It's coming up as I'm talking, and it's just like, uh. But, yeah, so I'm about to throw that up, and then hopefully I'll have energy when I'm done to go make food. I'm making some fish tacos tonight. Oh, so I'm going to walk y'all through that with me. And I always have to hella cross my legs because I will definitely take on myself. Not full on piss on myself, but pregnancy makes your body fucking weird. So, yeah. Ugh, I really have to throw up, but I don't got nothing in my system to throw up. It just feels queasy. And in order to get the queasiness away, I would rather just throw up whatever is in there so I can just get rid of it. Then my nose is starting to get stuffed up. Oh, I'm just gonna stop. Oh, I'm starting to feel lightheaded. Um, but I can't. Oh. Uh. 
I'm getting hot and sweaty. I gotta stop. Oh. Oh my god. Bro, I feel like I'm gonna pass out. Uh, how am I this nauseous and I don't got nothing in my system? Uh, like, uh, oh, God. Oh, God. Uh, 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 uh. Mommy sick, baby. Mommy sick. Yeah. Yes. Oh, I'm so hot, y'all. Oh. No way have I been throwing up for six minutes already. Okay, I'm gonna stop, y'all. I'm gonna stop. Y'all can rewind. It's my sword. This part. I'm done. I'm not doing no more. God. Oh. Huh? Oh. Now I gotta go up in here and cook food. Oh. Boy, do I love being pregnant. Oh. Luckily, the room is not that much of a mess today. It's 9.54. Y'all can't even see it. Oh, God. Fuck. I'm fucking hot as a bitch. I done just got hot. What are you doing? Nothing. Yeah, I scared you, didn't I? Go, go eat your food. Go sit up there and eat your food. Uh uh, just sit right here with me. What can you do? I'm doing ready. I'm doing ready. Okay. I'm cheating in my chair. Where did you put Lovey Bowls? Oh, gosh. Where's his bowls? Where's him? In the bag. Oh, you put him in there? Okay. What's he doing? He doing boots. He doing boots. He trying to eat your boots. It's, it, it's not the food. That's not the food. I don't know what I don't know what TV is. It's not dark, but I'm cold. I don't, I don't want to go ready. I don't want to go ready. I know. I'm going to turn this back on, actually. I don't want to go ready. I'm cold, too. I'm just going to turn the fan off. The fan? Mm -hmm. I mean, see, boy. Oh, God, y'all. I'm cold, too. I'm gonna go mine you one. Okay. You finna go get in the tub, baby. So I'm finna just make um fish tacos. I want taco too.
know this may not be the most lit vlog, the most fun or exciting, but my day is not fun or exciting every single day. Like, mm, it's it just is what it is. Mm. Ooh, so cold boots. That's it. Hey over there, so she eating her food, y'all. Oh man, it's right there. And the board. Um, and the board, yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm gonna show y'all what I season my fish tacos with. I just got fish. Um, I'm gonna use fajita seasoning. Just a little bit, because obviously he's not going to be for you. I want fish. You want fish? Yeah. I want fish. But I don't like fish. I want fish. Mm -hmm. I don't like fish. Yeah, Johnny going to like this fish. No, I don't like it. Mm -hmm. I want to taste it. Okay. I want to taste that. Okay, Mommy got to cook it first. Cook it in the cook. oven? So, yep, cook it in the oven. Um... Put some hot taco seasoning on there. <coughs> Bless your baby. <coughs> and you can put it on both sides, but I feel like salmon has a very distinctive salmon taste. And you kind of want it to be there a little bit, so I'm not going to over season it. This is adobo with sazon, all purpose. I really like this on my chicken. So I'm actually, I like chicken. Chicken nuggets. I never really put this on fish before. And I only got a little bit left, so. And I'm going to do some. Want to do some? Okay, Steve boy. Mm -hmm. I can get this out. I guess not. Yeah, that's not. I'll eat so, it. I feel like that's enough for real. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Because oh, I made I made some um oh, then later. I made some tortilla later, soup later. the other day. So I figure um Okay, it's enough. It's enough. So I figure um I can make this like a burrito mm. taco. And just dip. I uh, don't touch it. It's it's raw, it's raw fish. Um, I figure I could dip fish. my tacos in there. Taco. Anyway, I'm gonna put some butter on this and then put it in the oven. You can tell by how something smells if it's seasoned enough. You can definitely tell. Mm. Mm. Boy, poop. Oh, hi guys. I'm in me both, so I am in him.
Then I turned off the fan. Now I'm hella hot. Put it on 350 for 25 minutes and I'm gonna just check it. Check huh? it as I go. Aww. She's almost done with her food. She's doing a good job. She's doing a really good job. What are you doing? You doing meatballs? Huh? You doing meatballs and friends? Yeah. What night? It's because I haven't really eaten since that, um, since no. this morning. I only had one meal today. Um, yeah, I only had one meal all day. And, um, it was the cereal, but then I did make me a sandwich, a cheese sandwich, uh, with some french fries. And the smell of the grease, I just, I couldn't eat the food. So, I didn't end up eating that. I just made it for no reason. So, that's why I'm feeling so low in energy today. That's why I'm not really feeling that good. She's sitting here watching one of the SpaghettiOs fall. What? But, um, <clears throat> yeah. I ain't done. Oh, you done. Now nah, you finna go, you gotta go get a shower, okay? To bath? Not a bath, a shower today, cause mommy don't feel like running no bath water and letting you sit in there for a whole hour. I'm done. I'm do I did them. He needs my dress. Uh. Okay, I'm gonna get a bloody poop. Me too.
did not say no nigga. <laughs> Say me not a fan, not gonna come on. Like, damn. come on. Oh, I got this. Good job. Come on. I got this. I'm like, hold on to mommy. Oh, one, two, three. Okay, let's take a bite. Who? Okay, you didn't listen. You didn't listen. Go. You didn't listen. Go get in the shower. Yeah. Hey, Kamaya. Huh? Why is your baby dress off? Cause what? Just Cause you was painting her. Yeah. What did mommy tell you? Okay. You don't take people pants off, okay? Cause you don't want nobody to do that to you. Mm-hmm. Nobody's supposed to see your pee pee or your panties, right? Okay. Okay. <sighs> what is that smell? What's it? What smell? Mmm. I smell it. I did smell a white. I smell a stinky boy. You smell a stinky boy? No. Stinky boy. Go party? Yes, go party. Mm-hmm. All done? Let me yep. close this window. And don't try to So that you're not cold, huh? And don't try Chocolate? Yes. What chocolate? This one, the giant chocolate. Mm, come on. The giant chocolate is yummy, cheesy. Come on. 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 You always want me to get out. Yeah. Oh, I can't catch my breath. I saw. Oh, there we go. I caught it. That's been a struggle for me, catching my breath lately. Oh, it's like I can't. I 
Y'all can smell that salmon. You just got the tip. Okay. Don't call me when you all done and stuff when you in the bed. Mm, okay. Well, just call me. Okay, I'll let you. Yeah. Okay. So he just got out the shower. He said he's gonna be on his way. Home. Um. At this point, I'm not even vlogging the day. I'm not even doing the day. I think this is gonna be a really, really short vlog. Um. Yeah. I just want to wait for my man to get home. For real, for real. Y'all, I want to smoke so bad. Because I just feel so shitty. But I'm not. And my weed man literally just texted me too at 9.37. Like, I just got a fresh pack. Uh, but yeah, so I'm finna clean. Oh, y'all, that salmon smells so freaking good. It smells so good. That's crazy. You wouldn't think you would start smelling it already, but that shit smell good. Um, so I think I'm finna just set y'all up and let y'all watch me um straighten up our room and stuff uh cardi finna go pick up baby um i cannot wait till my man get here i cannot wait y'all last night when he got home usually one thing about when he gets home is i'm always doing something because i'm always doing something like by the time he get home I be wanting to make sure that dinner is cooked and the house is clean and Kamaya is already kind of like either playing in the tub or um, on her way to bed and stuff. And, and his ass lately, because he works so early, he been coming home so early and I'm not used to that. I'm used to him coming home. You Okay. I'm used to him coming home um, because of him working before, like what he was doing for work before, at like 2 in the morning, 1 in the morning, and now he comes home at like 7, 8, 9, and then we try to go to bed pretty early. Yes, baby? Huh? Yeah? Yes? Your car? Here I come. Um... But yeah, so usually when he gets home, usually when he gets home, I'm like cooking or cleaning or doing something. And last night, I just was like, forget it. I'm not finna do nothing. I'm finna just lay with my man. And we just lay in the bed to get together all night and cuddle with each other. And made some good love. <laughs> I just, I don't know. Like, this pregnancy has been bringing me so much closer to him. I just be wanting to be all over him all the time. I be needing him. I swear. I asked my brother to, like, come uh, come stay with me for a week. He's like, 
um, he finna be 15, and I had asked him to come stay with me for the week, you know, just to help out, because Jonathan works all throughout the week, um, and I, I realize I be needing help, like, I be so exhausted, and I try so hard not to be irritable when I'm exhausted like this, because as y'all can see, I'm not always like this, but on days where I don't have energy or I wasn't really able to keep anything down or something like that, um, huh, then I get really, really low energy and stuff like that. And right now I'm having a really, really hard time catching my breath. If y'all know what causes that, I know it's like an increase in progesterone and blood volume that makes it hard to catch my breath, but... I noticed that it happens when I'm hot or, like, in a shower and the shower is steamy or... I don't know. I just want to kind of stop talking and start cleaning up and stuff. So, that's what I'm going to do. Which one should I prioritize first? Which one is going to help me make the other dreams come true? Which one is going to help me manifest the other stuff that I want to come into fruition? But it's like... The thing I want the most right now is my car. That's what I'm manifesting the most. Just because I feel like it gives me a little bit of independence. Like I want my car and I hate having to rely on people. But then also... I feel like if I had a car right now, I would not save up for the, the um, stuff that I want for my businesses. Like, it's big purchases that I need for my businesses. And I feel like I want to get those first. Because if I get a car first, I feel like I'm going to be more inclined to go buy stuff, to just go to Walmart, to go to Target, to go to Home Depot and freaking Home Goods and Marshalls and... I just like going places, and I like shopping, and I like looking at stuff. Like, I can go on Target and be in there for hours just looking at home decor and 
clothes and baby stuff and stuff and this mind y'all this before i was even pregnant i just like looking at stuff i like going to the grocery store i like going to walmart um I'm, I'm a grandma i'm literally a grandma so that kind of stuff is my fun that's like my activity for the day so i don't know do y'all feel like y'all spend way more money when you have a car versus when you don't because i've also noticed that because of like doordash and uber eats fees and lyft fees going to and from places that kind of adds up as a whole bill within itself as well that's like a thousand dollars a month if you think about food and like me going to my friend's house or me going to my mom's house or me going to doctor's appointments um or jonathan going to work or something like that so i'm a big spender like i spend a lot of money and um one thing that i'm learning with being a business entrepreneur person is real life like money management and how blessings work like yes god will give you a blessing but you also have to put in the work to keep that blessing and i'm noticing that yes god keeps blessing me with all the finances that i need but now i'm in a position to work with god and keeping my blessings flowing if that makes sense so that's the process that i'm in right now i want to smoke so bad y'all like i don't even uh. but and and that's what i'm talking about i'm literally talking about not spending money and i'm like oh my god i want to smoke so bad literally it's just it's just emotions i don't even think i'll be wanting to smoke i think i'm just a spoiled brat and because i'm pregnant i just be like i want what i want and i really like think that smoking is a craving like and even if i don't give into it even if i don't have to smoke or anything like that it's still the feeling of wanting it It's just as bad as I would feel if I actually end up getting it, if that makes sense. Like, le <sighs> lately I have been wanting something sweet to drink. And I've just been craving it so much that everything that I drink, I don't feel satisfied. I don't feel happy with it. I don't feel like it did anything for me. And it's because I'm unsatisfied. Like, my craving is not being fulfilled. And that's what it feels like now that I can't smoke. Like, my craving is just never being fulfilled oh but yeah y'all i think i'm gonna go ahead and end it off here because um it's like 40 minutes and i haven't really been talking about anything i've kind of just been rambling so yeah y'all i hope y'all enjoyed this um not short vlog but very uneventful vlog i guess i made some food i got some money in the tub so i'm not even gonna say it was uneventful for those moms out there who's experiencing pregnancy with me y'all are gonna appreciate this kind of video just to kind of know and this is why i do what i do because um shout out to my man he got this song i can't wait till y'all hear that one but now that song is playing in my head um way to go sit back and i don't know i don't know the lyrics but when that song come out y'all just know um i forgot where i was going with that maybe he just thought about me because my mind got so sidetracked it um, but yeah yeah i'm out of here y'all oh yeah but this is why i do what i do so that People who are experiencing the same thing as me can feel like they have somebody to relate to, somebody to talk to, and somebody who understands them. I will be that person. A lot of people don't have sisters. A lot of people don't have friends or, you know, spiritual people in their life who experience truth, who, ex who lives in their truth, who talks about what they're experiencing. You know, so it feels good to have a shoulder to lean on. And when I tell you y'all are my shoulder to lean on, as y'all can see, my man not here. Kamaya be in her own world, kicking it, doing her own thing. Um, Y'all could kind of see in the beginning of the vlog, I was a little bit irritable. It was really, really hard for me to kind of like get her settled and get her together. Um, At first, we was laying in the bed, we was watching Barbie, or we was watching Miraculous. So, 
me and her were fine like i let her be on my phone um she was playing in the makeup and stuff like that so she was content but when i actually have to get up and get her to do stuff and she's really really tired right now so she gets in a super playful energy and when i'm drained it's kind of like it's kind of like you see somebody at school who's all loud and it's just like I'm not a loud person, so I can't vibe with you being that loud over there. That's how I be feeling. I'd be like, come on, like, relax, dude. Calm down. And I know I shouldn't do that because she has the right to, to be excited and to give me her energy, to put me in the energy of, hey, mom, let's play. Let's be fun. Let's. But, man, when you in the middle of feeling like this, it don't work. That's why I, I think I put out the camera because even just pulling out the camera it gave me drive it gave me motivation to film and to talk and to work through what i was feeling and now i'm starting to feel really nauseous because the smell in the house is that fish and it's a really really strong so yeah but i don't ramble i'm finna go ahead and get up out of here and i'm actually gonna upload this video right now so if you guys are seeing it the day that i'm uploading it just know this is in real time this is today 10 28 tuesday september 22nd okay so yeah i'm out of here y'all peace